cue here. Uh, we're going to do a 12 slices as we have balance on the bottom of the William Blake deck and getting that wheel spinning. We'll go into this one, which has Justice getting uh, balance to a solid, stable new beginning, the energy of December. So let's shuffle. And dive in. Aries, 10 cups. Coming in quickly there, Taurus. Gemini, keeping an eye on you. The person for Cancer is looking back deep. Not opening up for Leos. Virgo, decision time. Uh, temperance, uh, getting balanced and seeing the light. Libra, get an opinion, or they are. Uh, Scorpio, Sagittarius, mm, curious, curious about things. The moon, secrets there, Capricorn. Um, nourish yourself there, Aquarius and Pisces, the Hierophant. Become um, pious. Hmm. Over here that jumped out will be our, I guess, our three cards. When we get to calm waters and heal ourselves, we'll see the path towards the Ten Pentacles of making this dream actually dream uh, real. With the help of truth, Swiftness, we can get our wish fulfilled. Hmm. Change that perspective to get victory over the world. Mm -hmm. Take that world. Um, a queen of wands, a fire sign, has had heartache. We'll assume Leo about the path forward and changing that perspective, which is moving around this queen of coins, which nourishes and led to disappointment. Apologize, energy, interesting. Or masochistic hold up there. <laughs> interesting. Uh, okay, this wants to like be both, okay. This belongs with Leo as well. Death to indecision. Okay. Get the calm waters there so you can dream. The Hierophant is lighting the way to the ultimate. Healing ones. Hmm. Psyche, mind, spirit. Mm, cleanse your energy, Libra. Hmm. Um, choices, your horizons. Courage is coming in swiftly. Heartache is keeping one at a distance. Pretense is the secret that you're keeping. Deception from immaturity and collaborate with the world. Interesting. Becomes a choice and a question. Hmm. Hierophant on the bottom of the deck. That's where we ended. So let's uh, grab this and let's put a clarifier on each of these as well too. I just kind of like read the cards that were, I had and put them where they belong. Clarify all of these for us if we can. I'll inspire me to shuffle if I need to shuffle again. Uh, that's that, all right. Keep that there. This is for Leo, okay. <laughs> it's for Leo. <laughs> uh, Aries, the moon. Hmm. Something that you've kept hidden will be able to illuminate 
once the chaos is calmed down. It'll help you uh, see the dreams that you're wanting. Coming in swiftly with courage. Mm. It's a quick victory. It's usually like short-sightedness, but it's actually helps you learn. Interesting. There's a hesitation on that one. Um, keeping you at a distance is the heartache, Gemini. Be brave and leap in. Have faith in your heart. It can take a lot. <laughs> Someone from the past is choosing a... waiting for the perfect moment. And the wheel turns. I just see it spinning. Keep spinning instead of 180. Hmm. Leo, these carp jumped out. Devil energy and divine timing are control. Hmm. Interesting energy coming off of that. I get cahooting. And you're bound by it. Interesting. Um, a choice there to put an end to something. Um, or um, transform how you see the choices. As I'm looking at the lovers there. Uh, for Virgo. Two swords and death. I'm inspired to shuffle. All right, the Hierophant jumps out here for uh, Aquarius. And we have gathering information from others that have walked away from this in the past. Okay. Uh, temperance. Angel and healing up and resting will help get to that balanced energy, a calm stableness. You have to assess what you did or what they did. Depends on the energy that's bothering you. It's more or less what they did. Or, oh, also another layer is uh, an angel frequency is going to pull you into the right direction. I'm getting, like, Christmas carol energy. Hmm. I'm going to throw another card on that. And six of Cups was on the bottom. I went to grab it. But it's a hangman showing the position as this is it. Hmm. Has to do with money from somebody. So maybe that's helpful for you. Yeah. Someone from the past stole from you. All right, Scorpio, the world, and that collaboration energy that's on top of Virgo now. Um, Queen of Swords. You know what to cut out. You know what advice to take, and which ones not to. The choice is clear on the path of what to put an end to. That juggling energy. Okay. So. Judgment. Trust your judgment, Scorpio. That's That was what I was reading off of that. What I got from there. And confirmed by your clarifier. I like it. Um, someone with honor. And stability. And real is coming towards you Sagittarius however it's not going to be as exciting as you're used to but it'll be stable I'll throw another card because I'm inspired to yeah it won't be the um, flimsy excuse person that's always 
poison five of wands. <laughs> just um, excuses. Oh, no, I can't. Yeah, yeah just now. Interesting. Inspired to shuffle on this one. I'm getting uh, secret. Y'all's two energies is coming together there, I see. Hmm. Moon, keeping stuff repressed down and having a pretense about it. Or having to have to do pretense in order to keep the secret. It's stressing you out. Knight of Swords. So, resolve this quickly. Watching your every word. Hmm. I'm going to split. Bottom of the deck now is a wish fulfillment. Watching your every word. Fast coming energy. The world. Hmm. Ties directly to Scorpio? I don't know. Listen to what I said with Scorpio there. Trust your judgment. All right.